My name is Obeida. I was born in Jordan and as a young kid my family moved to Australia to start a new life and we've lived there ever since. Uh, currently I am a power plant engineer uh, with, a, with a global aviation company uh, that basically serves the aircraft and engine markets for lessors and airlines. As a kid I wasn't particularly very confident however there was one particular moment at school when one of my teachers was really motivating and he really just kind of pushed me. Uh, since then, I've developed uh, you know, strong confidence, but the trust, you know, you gotta believe in yourself and um, went on to achieve um, good things throughout that confidence. It is a special quote that says, nothing that's worthy comes easy. So whoever achieves something, you can look at it and say, oh wow, he's achieved it, but you can be sure that that guy or girl has gone through and back. That's the inspiration that I go by. So when I was a kid, I was just fascinated with aircraft. Same like I would say 90% of kids. As I grew up in school, I remember I landed a very special, um, I would call it like a scholarship, where you get to actually experience flying in Adelaide. The week before that was about to take place, I had a major accident where um, I stepped on a needle and I missed the opportunity. That was a stepping stone for me to pursue aviation because I knew it was unfinished business. The studies at UniKale really propelled my education and my current career simply because of two things. The first thing is that it is a mixture of classroom knowledge and hands-on experience as well as extracurricular involvement because you can't just have somebody who is good at you know, just books alone. The second way it helped me um, get to my current uh, career. Through UniKale, I was able to secure a scholarship. And that scholarship um, you know, paid for some tuition fees as well as um, gave me the opportunity to go to conferences. That's where I met my current employer. I told them about what I studied and um, as time went by, we kept in contact. And that's how UniKale basically was the pathway for me to land my first job. Oh, this is a very difficult question. Um, I, have, I have a lot of goals that I want to achieve in 10 years time. Uh, that really kind of focus on the aviation industry. And I would like you to put this on record. You can check this video in 10 years from now um, and you can search up my name and I'd, you will find out exactly where I am and that will be where I want to be in 10 years. I want to be very thankful to a lot of people in my life. Firstly, it's mom, my mom and dad. There's a, there's a quote that says, it takes a village to raise a child. No one just simply achieves where, where they are or achieves big great things on their own at lecturers at UniKale. Specifically, I have one particular or two particular that I want to thank. Uh, first is Dr. Hafizi from um, the Dean of UniKale Miat. Um, no international student has ever won the um, Chancellor's Award. He, he told me, I, I trust that you're going to do it. I want to also thank Dr. Suhaila. Um, she's my English um, lecturer at UniKale Miat. She's helped me out a lot throughout my study life and currently uh, with a lot of things. Um, my friends, I made the bold choice to come from Australia to Malaysia to study, uh, it's paid off.